Mark Medoff's Tony-winning drama Children of a Lesser God officially returned to Broadway this week in a new production directed by Kenny Leon. Headliners Joshua Jackson and Lauren Ridloff are at the center of this remarkable love story that takes place at a school for the deaf. We caught up with them on opening night. Feels pretty good. A Broadway debut period would be a big deal, but to be able to do it with something like this, which uh, just demands everything, is just an incredible experience. Forty years ago almost, you know, Mark Medoff put pen to paper, and uh, we had an opportunity to reinterpret that for this generation. It was quite special and timely. The show is a really good reminder for people to take a look at another person and listen to what they're really trying to tell you. Every day, especially with the political climate the way it is, everyone is thinking it's my way or the highway. And I think we need to knock it off. We need to really start connecting with one another, thinking about how we can come together rather than pull people apart. I think we're kicking too much beauty to the curb by only uh, listening to those people that look like us or sound like us. And the deaf community has the same wants, needs, desires, dreams, hopes as the hearing community. We have a responsibility to try to listen to each other. The cast and director Leon revealed why now is the perfect time for this revival. It, it, it thrives on universal themes, you know. Uh, love, living, listening, and that never gets old. Right now, there are so many different outlets. We have so many opportunities to speak out, but it feels like we're becoming more lost than ever. So I think that this play presents that to people again. I think that the universal themes of love and wanting to be understood resonate with everybody. That's what we all want as humans. That's the human condition. This love story between these two people who are desperately trying to understand each other, that's something universal that we all go through at some point in our life. And I think in this moment right now where we're having such a hard time being in true communication with people who are different from us or don't agree with us, I think that is incredibly relevant to this moment.